I'm Molly from Wilderness Inquiry. Today we'll be taking you on a Mississippi paddle tour from North Mississippi Regional Park to Boom Island. This river's character changes more throughout the 72 mile stretch of the Mississippi National River and Recreation Area than anywhere else along its 2,350 mile course. The river enters its northern corridor as a free-flowing prairie river and moves downstream to plunge over St. Anthony Falls into the river's narrowest gorge. In terms of wildlife, the river is home to species including otters, ducks, cormorants, herons, and fish. The charismatic great blue heron is the largest in North America. They measure in at about 4 feet in height and have a wingspan of approximately 6 feet. Great blue herons nest in treetop colonies, sometimes also called heronries. Colonies may consist of only a few nests, but some are much larger. Located 30 to 70 feet above the ground, their nests are typically found in large trees that often stand in water or on an island. This location may reduce nest predation by land-based predators, and nesting in colonies also increases the number of sharp eyes on the lookout for threats. This island, called Boom Island, was originally named for the booms that were used to separate logs floating down the Mississippi River to sawmills that were powered by St. Anthony Falls. Originated in 1940, the city of Minneapolis hosted the annual Aquatennial Festival. Held each year during the third week of July, this festival celebrates the city's famous lakes, rivers, and streams, including the mighty Mississippi. <laughs> 